start out with simple string, a cup, which is basically going to be a sail, put a hole in the cup, tie a knot, and that's basically it. Now you're not going to play a little, the kids game we used to play, telephone, but it's something similar. Take the cup, insert it in your tube. In this case, I've got a 20 foot tube going down that trough. It easily will travel 60 foot, 80 foot. It'll go through bends. It'll do anything. So it really saves you time. You do not have to take apart your whole pneumatic system if you want to clean the tubing. Then just blow it through. And as you blow it through, it'll pull the string rather easily. It's through. Sorry you didn't get to see that. Let me try that again. And the string here is, you know, all over the place. And your cup and your 20-foot tube. And just give it power. It's through. As I say, it will go through bends. It will go through straight tubing. Go through sleeves. And you insert your lubricated foam or sponge, in this case urethane, or whatever you want to put in there, cotton rags, and uh, go to the blog and you'll see the recommended solutions we put in here, but it's basically just water-based detergents, and you're free to use some isopropyl alcohol or denatured alcohol if you've got some stuff in there that won't come out with water. That's it. Go to the other side and pull. It will pull through bends, it will pull through anything as long as your string is a good quality string, it's not going to snap on you. So I'm doing the best I can do with one guy with one camera, but taking the string, you can see at the other end, you've got your sponge, and I am pulling it through. Not just passing through some grime, it is really going over it. And here we are now toward the end. And we take the tube and we pull through. And I don't know if you can see that, but all the little sawdust that we used to put in there is now removed. And the tube has been cleaned.